no luck shit, Sag. Oh, little brother luck shit. Oh, double luck shit. Easy clap, dude. Alright, little brother's gonna get it. Easy clap, dude. Right, right, right. There it is. I fucking knew it. <laughs> Good job, little brother. That's uh, nothing new right there. Uh huh. Alright, hey yo, how's it going boys? What is up? Stars back once again for yet another character impression. This time we have the long-awaited mouse uh, favorite character, Husbando, Sandophone. He is apparently an Earth Grand character. I actually forgot what was his stats. <laughs> I already ringed him. Well, shit. I can't math for shit, so I need to go back to this page. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Uh, he has 1080. Oh my god, we, we, we go uh, last gen. Two gens ago, man. 1080 Ti, dude. 1080 HP and 9800 attack. Okay, so his earth and his grand, blah, blah, blah. His sword, katana, yes. Oh, uh, if you haven't realized it already, little brother luck shit him. So there you go. His ogi is massive for damage to a phone. Next elliptica activates twice. Wow. Okay, that sounds very familiar. Itiro po prison. I almost said poison there for some reason. Earth damage to all foes. Elemental friction effect? Prison of war. Original element has been lost. And water element has been gained instead. Deals water damage. Excludes plane damage can't be removed. Charged diamonds don't fill up. Can't use special attacks. Water element has been gained instead. So he deals water element? Wait, no, I don't think so. This is like the the debuff that the bosses or whatever tends to do. Yeah, I think that's what it does. Because I know it happens on your party member like Europa or some shit, right? Yeah, I think that's what he essentially does. I don't think anyone actually has this before. Because we always have like elemental switch or whatever. I guess this is technically elemental switch too in a way. But it's just only limited for Phytons, but Phytons is a long time though. Alright, so Elliptica is the second skill, the one that activates twice, right? Uh, Earth damage to a full steal one of the Tetra elements? What the fuck is this? What the fuck, you slug right now or some shit? What's this Doto effect shit? What the fuck? <laughs> Hit to fire, water, earth, or wind attack boost to cast this attack of the stolen element. Uh, I think I, uh, I mean, I guess I'm a little bit thankful that little brother has him or some shit, so at least I can test him out. Because <laughs> I don't understand what the fuck is that. Who knows, 8 turns and fire turns. The vice removes all buffs from all other allies and foes. Instant CA standby to all, to standby to cast the boost to CA specs. Removes all buffs and allies and foes. Interesting. Four Primarch's wings. Bonus damage effect to each stolen element. Buffs can't be removed once Sandalphon has all the Tetra elements. Okay, so this one, I guess it kind of works like uh, Mugen style, I suppose. So it's basically you can get up to four buffs. Four different buffs at a time, which is basically any of these shit. This is what I live for. Can restore HP. Takes damage every turn, boost to critical hit rate, damage cap, sharp boost to defense. Deals multi-attack, converts some turn-based damage into HP recovery. Huh. Interesting. Skill cap. Okay, maybe CA cap is not as, as, as good as I thought anymore. Skill cap, debuff success, earth attack. CA damage, oh yeah, then the rest is like the same thing. I mean, I guess end of the day, you want to max this too, and this too. I mean, this is three is the important one, the rest you can put whatever, I guess. Yeah, it doesn't really matter. Wait, I don't need to press that. Oh, he can essentially get four, huh? Four echoes. Hmm. So that's his heal. So he can only get heal from that, huh? Oh, 
Hashtag blessed. Nice. You cast that twice, but I got fire again. Does he heal back? That's a lot of heals though. Oh my. Maybe I should fully debuff it. I think I should be able to cap just fine with stuff. Man, that shit must be fucking really high accuracy rate too, I think. Jesus Christ, his echoes. Jesus, fuck his echoes. What the fire again? Come on, dude. <laughs> Give me the final one. I want to see it. back so much though. <laughs> Oh wait. Wait what? Oh never mind. <laughs> Look what the fuck is that damage? My grid sucks! My fucking grid sucks! Uh what is AoE as well, that thing? Oh, Earth and Wind, alright. Oh, the echoes. Damn echoes. Damn, those echoes though. Shit, boy. Oh, triple attack too. How useful.
Okay, I took like no damage at all. Cool. <laughs> I like how he's doing that non-stop because he has that debuff there. <laughs> Jesus Christ, man. I guess it's still somewhat okay though. This one has really long cooldowns too. It turns is relatively long. God fucking hell, man. He has so much echo. And he looks so hard. Can you like get all that shit already, bruh? How many more turns do you need? Oh my goodness. He actually needs a lot of turns for that, though. <laughs> he actually needs a lot of turns for that one, though. Unfortunately. Just to get all of that. I mean, I guess that's kind of like one of the balancing facts for him though, I suppose. Like, if he can get that 4 echoes super easily, right? I think he'll be just way too broken though. So I think it's okay. Yeah, I think it's fine though. That's a good balance though, either way. But I guess if he can actually get e Earth Echo early, I guess that's better though. Because that, er that fucking Echo is so high though, by the looks of it. His Echo amount is really, really high by the looks of it. <laughs> Bro, I think I'll win an earth you gave me win an earth you gave me. <laughs> Come on dude <laughs> Why you do this to me? I like how Naru's uh, assassin doesn't do any damage. <laughs> That's kind of unfortunate. That's very, very unfortunate. He really doesn't take damage at all, too. He heals looks pretty fucking nuts, though. But then again, maybe I just take way too little damage or some shit. I need to wait until 10% for this guy to deal damage to me. Alright, nuke me hard, baby. Nuke me hard. As hard as you can, baby. Hit me. Yes. Is he dead? <laughs> Alright, he's dead, unfortunate. 
Little brother doesn't have enough HP, Sedge. <laughs> <Sag. laughs> okay, I wasn't expecting that hard. Sorry, I'm sorry. Ah, <laughs> uh, that's unfortunate, man. Uh... Little brother doesn't have enough HP, Sedge. <laughs> I need more katanas. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I mean, he only has like 12,000 HP though. Like, that's like quite a massive difference between Little Brother and Big Brother. <laughs> I mean, I guess I could give him a bit more HP with this, I suppose. Uh, I mean, it would be kind of cool if he actually managed to survive that. Because he looks like he has really high defense too, from what I'm seeing. He doesn't take that much damage, even without my armor or whatever stuff. Like, I had no Uriel buff or whatever shit. He still takes like almost no damage at all. When compared to the other character, seems to have been taking a little bit more damage. But then again, I am actually technically buffed by Lumberjack shit though. Let's all see how much he can potentially heal himself for. I mean, there's no doubt he's just fucking strong already. That's like so obvious already. Oh wait, he can actually just use it at turn one. I mean his damage is not that bad either I'm like you have to keep in mind that I'm using like almost Like sh The shittiest grid you could probably think of And his damage is like what the fuck <laughs> Yeah remember my grid sucks ass okay like as you saw right, like I, I can't even assess him properly in Naru, like ever. I can't even hit like 1 million plus. I only hitting like 500k right? Oh 700k, see? <laughs> Assassin is not even doing anything for me. <laughs> At least he thinks 600k. His raw damage is really really high. For a shitty grid like mine. Hit him. 700 man. It's fucking almost half H half, half of the damage because of his. And he heals full too! Like, what the fuck? Like, I feel like he's. He, he heals so much though. Like, the amount of damage he's taking, he's healing back so much. Alright, right, hit me again, baby. Hit me, baby, one more time. <laughs> yes! He got debuffed. Nice. I have no clear. Cool. Earth and, earth, earth and water again. Oh no 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 no. I have three now. I have three echo now. But he has the stupid debuff and I can't clear. Because I have no hangman yet. <laughs> so he has three echoes now. Oh now she has that too. Ow. Oh shit. Oops. Whatever. <laughs> I forgot to check before I start. I I probably need to go grab the ones from from my stream as well now too.
But he does look. Hmm. Oh, what on earth again? Come on, man. Where's my win, dude? I want to see all four. Because <laughs> he has that new shit, right? Dude, I want to fucking see that though. Hmm. Is actually little brother a Land on him, man. Land that shit on him. <laughs> Come on, give me win. Yes. Wow, this spell is so good. Yes, he has all four now. Numbers. All right, and more numbers. Let's go. Oh, numbers! All oh, those numbers. Yes, it got the hit. Yeah, man. Come on, dude. I probably should rank up higher too, just so you can have more HP. Oh, he has 13,000 HP too. It's not a lot. See, he's healing what she's doing to him. <laughs> Look at them numbers, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Wow. He can be so crazy in the late game, man. Like, late game as in, like, when it lasts for this long. <laughs> I'm 
See, this this is the this is the thing right now, you know, like the characters carry so hard nowadays. It used to be it used to be how like the grid is like so important. It's really gearing towards Dan right now. Like the characters carry so fucking hard. My grid sucks ass and it hits so hard, man. Like what the what the fuck is this shit, man? It's fucking nuts, dude. I mean, look, look at this pay to win comp. <laughs> this is like a pay to win comp right there. Look at this. Pay to win. Yeah, I mean, just get lucky, right? Easy forehand. And that his 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 S1 has really high accuracy too. I mean I've been like kinda mashing it off cooldown in a way. And he still lands all the time too. Like that's fucking nuts. I didn't even upgrade his fucking EMP yet too. Oh wait, I should actually should not press that. Whoops. Oh well, whatever. I should have pressed it later because she's gonna buff herself. It's fucking crazy how I can hit like 5 million plus with this shit ass grid. Are you gonna heal yourself, fool? That's quite a. Oh, you can only heal 1000. Okay, I didn't know that. <laughs> So his max heal is 1,000. Yeah, that was the one I was looking out for. Yeah, 1000 is the max one. It's alright though. He can heal, but... He already does so much either way. If you think about it, like fuck man. I mean, I, I didn't expect to be pushing this far as little brother either way. Does pot work on him? Yeah, of course not. <laughs> nice HP! Nice! 6969, baby! Wait, even he doesn't take damage, he can auto heal himself too? Oh, wow, okay. <laughs> oh, wow, that's fucking insane then. Well, that's pretty nuts! I didn't know that. He doesn't need to take damage for him to heal himself. What the fuck? See, he's healing himself. 
He doesn't need to take damage and he can heal himself? What the fuck? That's broken! Because <laughs> from, from what I understood about the thing, it just says that he, he, he takes partial of the damage. He heals partial of the damage taken. That's pretty fucking nuts though. Wow, I'm dying, no. <laughs> I am dying, lol. Alright, little brother needs some heals now. On his other characters. Oh, he did now, F. Alright, I mean, we already know how he is, right? It's fucking crazy, man. Yes, this shitty grid. <laughs> He's doing so much damage with my shitty ass grid. That's only one skill level 20, the rest skill level 10. This guy is hard carrying himself. <laughs> fucking stupid, man. This one is kind of like whatever, though, because this is like. To get. To get all the tetra elements is gonna take you fucking forever anyway because it's so RNG unless you just luck shit. So you can get it in like 6 turns or something. But that's usually not the case anyway, right? You can kinda ignore this but I feel like as long as you get the earth damage, uh, I mean the earth damage thing, I think it's already good enough. And that adds so much damage. I think this adds up a lot though. This thing is pretty high I think. But I'm not sure how much is that. Probably like what 30 to 50% probably. <laughs> it looks like it's really high though. This. This thing. And this one is kind of like a meme I feel like but I don't think it really matters though. Because I remember trying to do this in turn 1. Because because nowadays right, you look at Earth right, Earth has so many characters that has self buff that doesn't have uh, can be re they have a lot of can be removed shit going on. So this I feel like it doesn't really fucking matter anyway, this remove all buffs from other allies thing. I feel like it can technically kind of use that off cooldown as well. Because I know it can, can be kind of bad in a way because like it could kind of like uh, screw you over. Especially like if you are using those characters have a lot of the buffs and then you remove all that shit right? So it kind of screws you over in that sense isn't it? But like... Because <laughs> unless you're using like a... Uh, that, that whole, you know, the pay to win setup, all the, the seasonal characters, limit, limited characters or whatever shit. Yeah, I'm, very, I'm fairly certain you don't really have to, to, to bother about this at all. You can pretty much just use this off cooldown. And you can probably use this for the full auto as well from what I can see. <laughs> but I guess in a way, if you're planning to use this in full auto, you kind of want to like... Use this in turn 1, then only use this in turn 2 in a way, so you kind of like prolong your full auto just a little bit because you can at least get this immediately right because this is not like it's not like those characters where it refreshes on on ogi or whatever shit right it just allows you to use twice basically and every ogi now this one is pretty sick though like i'm consistently using this on europa and i don't think it actually whiffed at all it looks like it's always there that means this thing is fucking insane then so it's like i feel like you you will want this, just for his second skill, I think. This one. Which is, I guess, is good for far, I suppose. Either far or Babu, I, I guess. But I don't think that really matters now, does it? Yeah, I think I should just get skill cap for him. I think skill cap on him is, like, way better. And from what I've also noticed, right, his third skill CA specs is pretty fucking huge, though. Because he adds it, like, it allows, it allows my little brother to did, like, fucking 5 million plus. I'm pretty sure you saw that earlier. Probably not on Europa because that thing has higher defense and I obviously can't hit that high because, you know, my grid sucks ass anyway. <laughs> no, I think I did that on the dummy or some shit, like, 5 million plus? Like, what the hell? <laughs> and I'm not supposed to be able to cap that high in the first place because, like, the only thing I have on my grid is... This fucker, which is, yeah, is a max limit break Odell. But I do not have, uh... I do not have, uh, Seraph... Uh, I mean, pra Arkaram Summon. I do not have this maxed out. This is only like, what? Yeah, it's only a fucking full, fully upgraded SR. It's not even SSR yet. <laughs> so you can kind of tell, like, how much... And I don't even have Opus yet, as you can tell. <laughs> so, like, I'm not supposed to be able to cap that high. This shit must be fucking huge, then. <laughs> This thing is fucking huge! It's so fucking strong and it's cool now, it's not even that long either! Like, this is only 5 turns, this is 8 turns, this is 8 turns, sure. But by all means, I think this is to be given anyway, this thing is so fucking huge, this... 
This debuff is crazy good. This, I would say, is pretty damn crazy good as well. Especially if you're, like I said earlier, if you're using it for, like, all the... The, 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 the limited characters or whatever. Because it's not like you're gonna get your buffs removed anyway. Because, like... For example, I'm using with this, this team, right? Plus, MC doesn't have this shit. Like... This thing can be removed, and this is the important one. I don't think that really matters, right? And then if I'm using Naru, all his shit doesn't get removed anyway, too. So why does that matter? Same goes for her, for a chicken, right? This shit doesn't get removed, too. So why does that matter? <laughs> so it's... It, that's why I think, like, he he's good, like... He's so fucking good across all levels. Like, if you have the shittiest grid in the world, he's gonna hard carry your ass. He's like, what the pure definition of not needing a grid. He can hit so hard without needing a grid. He's, f yeah, he's 100% preferred, man. I have not even looked at his weapon yet, and his character itself is so fucking crazy. Alright, what's his weapon like? I know it's fucking stupid, right? Where is it? Ah, yes, no wonder it's so fucking stupid. Big skill cap and supplemental damage. Yeah, you definitely want this. <laughs> you definitely want that in your, in your cave Highlander what? shit. Yeah, that, that, is, that is no doubt. It's a sword, right? Wait, it's a sword, right? Yes, it's a sword. Doesn't matter. Even better for him too. And not, yeah, not to mention he's a fucking sword and katana user. That shit is something like so easy to build into, right? Which essentially builds, I mean, adds a lot of damage, a lot of HP for him. So that's why that's why it's it's so common, right? That shit is so common. You can just increase his stats so easily. <laughs> what a stupid character! What a fucking stupid character, man. Oh, he gets the spell cancel on full movement break too. Yeah, even fucking better. Yeah, that, you, you definitely want to full movement break his weapon because of that shit. But yeah, I think when it comes to rings, you kind of want to get skill cap in instead now from what I'm seeing. Because I feel like you do more with skill cap compared to CA cap. But I guess CA cap works too either way. I don't think you need double attack because this guy 100% double attack anyway, so why does that matter? <laughs> yeah, this, this thing is a meme. Trip, I, triple attack works, of course. Because he doesn't have hundred, he's, he doesn't have guaranteed triple. He only has guaranteed double attack, so he's basically like six in a way. But either way, hundred percent preferred. He's probably really high on that. If you're wondering why have, have I not updated the thing, because I've been busy playing the game a lot. No time to to even do that. So yeah, there you go. Yes, yeah, so that's my impressions on Sunophone. I think I've been dragging this for one fucking hour already. But uh, yeah, it's probably gonna be a one hour video. Hope you enjoyed that, and I'll see you guys on the next one. <laughs> okay. Oh, like, subscribe, dude. Yeah, thanks. <laughs>